In Wyoming, high tunnels serve a wonderful purpose in extending our season a little bit in the spring, um, but much longer in the fall. We're going to show you some of the coverings that are used on high tunnels. On these high tunnels here, the sides are made of a very sturdy, strong polycarbonate material. The other covering that you see on this particular high tunnel is double polyethylene and we have two layers on the roof of these two high tunnels here. The polyethylene actually will last about three years. The polycarbonate, the rigid end walls, are actually rated for 20 to 30 years. One of the other benefits to the uh, double layer polyethylene, this softer plastic, is that it allows us to roll the sides of the tunnels up and down. Last night, for example, it was very chilly, low 30s here, so we had the sides rolled down to keep that heat inside each of the high tunnels. This particular one is a woven plastic type. The thing that you have to keep in mind with the woven fabrics, if, if they do tear, uh, they will shred. There are a number of coverings that one can use on high tunnels. They all have their benefits, they all have their disadvantages. It's pretty much just up to the owner to decide what type of cover they would like. For University of Wyoming, this is From the Ground Up, and I'm Karen Panther.